Well, Coach, first of all, uh, how's the turnout for the Melrose Volleyball team so far? What is the breakdown of the numbers? Oh, our numbers are good. We're at about 40 kids 9 through 12, which is higher than it's been since I've been here. So uh, we got six seniors, about 12 juniors, um, well, just a few sophomores and quite a few freshmen. Mm -hmm. So just keeping up with uh, each year now, who are the seniors out there that we're going to see from Melrose? Uh, we've got Avery Bitts will set for us, Abby Hinnenkamp, Delaney Anderson, Taryn Van Heel, Kayla Ousting, and Lexi Fredericks. Mm -hmm. And overall, uh, what's your view of the Melrose team going in? Uh, what kind of strengths do you think this team will have? We look good. And, uh, we had a really good summer. We're, our ball control looks solid. Um, we've got we've got a lot of offensive weapons this year that we haven't really had in the past. Um, we've got six solid girls that can put the ball in play and, and can terminate when we need them. So, yeah, we're, we're looking good right now. You know, as you mentioned, Avery Bits, and you're also the, the softball coach. And I want to kind of compare the two in a sense that uh, she's a leader as a catcher on the softball team and as the setter. Can you kind of compare those two sports and what she does? Oh, absolutely. She uh, she's really embraced her leadership role this year for volleyball. Um, she stepped in and she she's telling people where to go. She leads she leads our offense and she uh, she kind of keeps us cool and calm out there. So that's kind of that's kind of her strength. And certainly in volleyball, you got to hit it. Who are the hitters out there for Melrose? Well, you got Mia Meyer on the right side, who's back, who keeps growing. Uh, McKenna Schmiesing was injured this summer, so she hasn't really been back yet. But I think she'll come out. Um, Pretty quick here. Abby Hinnenkamp on the outside. Mache Cheetah on the outside as well. Uh, Cassie Klopaki is looking really good. Uh, Delaney Anderson's coming around. We're, we're pretty stacked right now. Mm -hmm. And also, I think uh, the depth of the team, that's going to be a, a key, isn't it? Oh, yeah. We've got um, some sophomores. Uh, Greta Klopaki, sophomore setter, who's coming in, looks really, really good. Maddie Duffner is playing really well in the middle. Uh, a couple freshmen who look good. So, yeah, we're deep this year. You know, as you see the first poll that came out, you see Ricori number two. You'll see them in the playoffs probably. Uh, you've got Morris in the conference in the top ten. You know Sox Center is going to be right there. But uh, what kind of motivation that does that give the Melrose team? Because I'm sure you're going to say, too, Melrose is in that mix, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely. We're we're hoping to to play with everybody that, I mean, beat some teams that we probably shouldn't beat, and but beat everyone that we should. Um, hopefully we'll make some noise uh, throughout the year as we keep getting better and better.